All right, this, my name is Gary. They call me Rattlesnake. This is Joplin, four-year-old German Rottweiler, rides with me 24-7. And I got him here at the show four years ago. The guy delivered him, actually in this same spot I was parked. Put him up in the truck and my other one retired and stuff. And, but he's getting better. I mean, four years, he's starting to learn to protect the truck, protect me, watch for people and stuff. And that's his job. I mean, that's the way he gets paid by the food for. Uh, crackhead tried to jump in my truck in Atlanta and I rolled him up in the window and went out the passenger door called Georgia State Patrol. And they came out there and the whole time, 20, 30 minutes, the guy's hanging in the window in Kiev, a Rottweiler about his size, just chewing him up, just having lunch for him. And a uh, cop came out and goes, well, why is the guy frailing like that? I was like, well, my dog's having a conversation on that door right now with him. And they drug him out, cut him all up on his arms and his face and everything. And no charges, I didn't press charges, so I figured the guy got short in his stick. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, but yeah, he saved my life. He got steak dinner for a week on that one. So, Kiev, Kiev immediately could pick out a danger person. You know, he's still kind of learning. He's only four. He's kind of picking it up, and it's just something that'll have to take time with him. I, uh, I may tear up. Um, his ashes are on the dash here. Yeah. Yeah. I don't say any more. I'll tear up. So. He was, he was a real good truck dog. He, he protected me, saved my life. He did, he did what he was told to do out here and didn't, didn't balk at it, you know. You know, that, I probably am, I've been out here 25 years, some, you know, and I've always had Rottweiler with me, so that's a great deterrent of people, but I've probably had two, three life-threatening incidences out here. One where I actually had to draw down on somebody in a parking lot. But 25 years I've I've carried out here and I've never, that's, I mean, I didn't draw down and point at him. I came to, you know, hey, I, I have it right here, you know, but I think, I think, uh, I think we should have a, a, a carry weapon for truckers. I mean, <coughs> I, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's one thing I really kind of was, but the thing is, if you're going to be a trucker and carry a gun, I'm an advocate for training. I mean, I go to range every once, two months and, and qualify myself and shoot my gun every, so I'm, I'm proficient with my weapon, you know, and drivers with hot heads, maybe some issues, shouldn't be carrying. I think it's a driver on driver basis, but I think we should have a, a permit. I have a concealed permit, so I'm good in 38 states. But if I go into New York City or whatever, or Jersey, I, I get caught with it in my truck, I'm, I'm in trouble. You know, but I've never been caught, so I don't really care about those things. But, I mean, I, these drivers sometimes don't feel safe, you know, even carrying guns because they're afraid they're going to go to jail or whatever because there's no, I mean, but that's my preference, you know. I, I, I look at it this way. I'm coming home alive. Rather I come, come home and have to go to prison to come home or I come home, I'm coming home alive and it's just too dangerous.